we look at gazelle migration. The first main obstacle is the river, where strong currents, crocodiles and rogue fishermen all pose a threat to these gentle creatures. In recent years, bridges have greatly improved gazelle's chances, but how do others feel about this? We interviewed the local cock to find out. Well, it's a very important time of the year when the antelopes cross the river. It's a beautiful time when I get to tear them from limbs from limb and get to devour their flesh and swim and bathe in their blood. <laughs> oh, sorry, I got a bit carried away. But, but, but now they've discovered that freaking bridge they're crossing over there, and I can't cast them anymore, and it really pisses me off. Has it occurred to you that you could just wait for them on the bridge? No, but that's a very good idea. Oh, I would love to listen to their screams as I perform my massacres. Oh, I love the sound. Gazelles will be travelling north from Appleby Park to the common feeding ground, the Appleby Co-op. As they make their way towards the town, the gazelles are distracted by swings. Everyone knows gazelles love swings. <laughs> it's now a good opportunity to interview two of the herd leaders. This is our fourth migration together. Yeah, it, it, uh, it's, uh, yeah. it's going better than normal. Yeah, so far we, we, we the, the bridge has been built, so uh, we'd have to go through the river where we normally lose quite a few, quite a few uh, friends. We lost and about 60% last year, and this year it's about three, so it's been a huge impact there on numbers. Yeah, and uh, as you can see, a, a monkey has joined us. He's obviously got lost and joined us in our migration for some reason. Nobody knows why. Yeah. So we like grass. We, we do like grass. Topic. That's partly we why we're here. We love grass, in fact. But, um, I can't yeah. get enough of that grass. Especially not that, that new low fat grass that's about. Yeah. Where are you migrating to? Uh, we're actually going to the, the co-op. Yeah. It's uh, quite a long way from here, but, you know. We can make it. We've done it before. We've done it before. Yeah. Yeah. I think I think it'll be a good a good year this year. It will, hopefully. We have good expectations. We've got, we've got a strong herd this year, so. The best herd we've ever had. The first most likely cause of death for a gazelle is leopard attack. The cunning creature stalks its prey and can remain undetected due to its camouflage. Um, as a, a leopard, I'm a master of, of hunting. As you can see, I've got myself one here, so it was pretty easy. Didn't put up much of a fight. The rest of them seemed to get away, but uh, I think I got them. Obviously, I'm master of disguise, master of cunning. I can pretty much make anything into a disguise. Just gone. Just disappear off the off the earth. I mean, you can't even see me. Just disappear. It's all in the legs, really. Just in the flexibility. The gazelles leave the park, but their troubles are far from over. Leopards aren't the only predator on the loose. <laughs> Lions are known for having an unfair hierarchy. It's not great. They make us do all the work. Yeah, we have to go all the way over there to get some food for them. They just sit there on their bongos all day. That's why they're so fat. They don't move. Come on, baby. It's tough. Come on, let's 
chase the gazelles, we can show you in slow motion how they bring down their prey. Anyone without an HDTV right now is missing out on this incredible experience. The town offers many exciting things for gazelles. One is distracted by the bargains in a shop window. We mourn the loss of the gazelle so far. Let's take a look at the monkey. I'm a monkey. And, uh... What do you think about this whole migration business? What's the point? I mean, you're coming back in a few weeks. One of the last obstacles to face is the road. From the last decade or so, these have been full of fast moving vehicles that thwart the gazelles with their shiny metal casing. One of the herd is unfortunately distracted by a mobile phone. <laughs> Tragically, one out of five gazelles are run over when crossing the roads in England. Remaining gazelles finally make it to the co-op. Did you bring the money? Oh. Where's the money? Well, I haven't got any. Oh, oh for God's sake. Oh. <laughs> oh well, maybe next year. Next on Channel Dougal, watching paint dry covers beige before finding hay in a needle stack. Next week on Animal Kingdom, we look at the urban animals. <laughs>